Alright, so here we are, morning of our great adventure across the world. I get a call at 4 30 in the morning. Yeah, I forgot my passport. Spent like all night, went to bed at 2 o'clock, nowhere to be found. It's interesting. I think I think you need a passport mm. when you go overseas. <laughs> <laughs> That's just a wild idea, I think mm. so. A couple of days before I I totaled my car. Right? And so we took it to the shop and they told me like, uh, it's totaled, you're gonna have to get a new car. When Samson picked me up, total. So I think I know my passport is. Yeah? Yeah. Like, where's your car? It's in the shop and it's locked in the back. <laughs> so we drive over to the shop. Mm -hmm. it doesn't look like they're open, man. Dang it. Obviously it's closed because it's 4 in the morning. And I'm like, dude, how do you get your, how do you get your passport, man? Just, uh, let's just park and see what, see if anyone's here. Yeah, yeah. knock on the door. There might be something. There was a gate there that I, I, I thought I could climb. And so um, I try to look at it from different angles. Like, is there a, a place where I could put my foot to jump over? Fortunately, there was just a little crack in the gate that I could squeeze through real quick and just shit me through. Now I'm at the lookout, man. So I'm sitting there trying to, trying to make sure the cops mm -hmm. didn't call on us because we're not actually breaking in. This is just No, there's no laws were broken. Yeah, yeah I was yeah. going to my car that was parked, and locked in passport. the back. In your car. Yeah, it was, right. yeah. It's my property. Yeah, on their property. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Better break through their property, get to your property. Yeah. yeah. I opened the door because it was my property. Yeah. I looked in the glove compartment. Sorry, not the glove, glove compartment is this way, but the glove, sorry, the, the middle console. It's a weird car. The <laughs> middle, <laughs> made in Japan. Uh, it was a middle console, and what do you know? My passport was in there. Grabbed it. Nico's booking around the corner, man. After I shimmy through, <laughs> back through. He's ready. Go, go, go! <laughs> Jump in the car. We peace out. I got it. Let's go. What? <laughs> but we were good. We were going we we international. This show is all about showing up to the airport to see what happens. Mm -hmm. some grilled onions in there and some um, jalapeno with this cheese. I don't know. I'm going to call it craft cheese because it's so good. Oh, dude. That cheese. Oh, that gets for me, like cheese is the greatest invention of all time. Like cheese makes American food taste good, Mexican food, Italian food. Like Japanese food doesn't have cheese, but once you put cream cheese in a small roll, oh, it takes it to a whole another level like cheese is the best invention of all time so i'm not so too crazy about cheese <laughs> <laughs> but i'm glad he loved his cheese so so the so the electric pulse is going through all of our hands the game is whoever let's go loses loses Woo! Get, get, get. <laughs> <laughs> That's how good it is. <laughs> then we decided to get really crazy. Oh yeah, we really did. wild. I mean, we're in party oh, town, snap, right? We're in party city. And our hotel is smack dab right in the middle of of all um, everything that's happening the action. outside, right? Oh. People coming in, partying. Music. Yeah. Yeah, a bunch of a bunch of fraternities were there. Oh, oh. Was like, oh yeah. It's, it's time to get oh. wild. Hot, hot dog. <laughs> 